Embedded software. What is the biggest challenge for developers? What exactly is embedded software? It's the brain of the launcher. It is set for each flight and allows the rocket to navigate independently once the engines have been started. All the phases of the mission are programmed within it. It controls the smooth progress of the flight and is ready for any events that may occur. It reacts accordingly and adjusts the launcher's actions in real time. It is placed in the equipment bay right at the top of the launcher. It usually takes between five and 10 years and a team of 100 people to develop it. Just to recap, the embedded software is able to send a 750-ton rocket into space to analyze and respond to all eventualities, and all this with complete autonomy. Not bad, is it? But that's not all. Once in space, the launcher and its software are no longer protected by the Earth's magnetic field. Without adequate protection, solar radiation would damage them. So the engineers have designed dedicated electronic circuits to withstand this extremely hostile environment. And that's how you fly a rocket into space, through solar radiation, at 8,000 kilometers per hour.